Can we stop acting like she's in Guantanamo? I mean, Jesus Christ. Salam alaikum. What? What's that you'll refrain from using religious figures as expletives in the trial? Oh, I'm sorry. Was my language too abrasive for the terrorist delegates of the village? Shut your mouth! Uh, she, she was talking to me. Did you hear what she said? You're who talking are you? to Tell me. your you client are. she can't speak to me. Be nice. If you can't control your client. It's Arabic for peace be upon you. I know what it means. Clear, How Muslims clear, are clear, supposed to clear, greet other Muslims? Did you read that on Wikipedia or did your ISIS boyfriend tell me? Don't answer that. that. Your Honor, I apologize. Your, your Honor, Honor, I don't mean to criticize you or your court, don't, but given the way the media already conflates Islam and terrorism, I think it's irresponsible of you to allow this much press at the arraignment and completely unacceptable for the defendant to be dressed as she is. She should not be allowed to wear a headscarf in jail. What? That's not fair. There are real Muslims I am currently Muslim. incarcerated who have been denied the right to cover. You're saying we shouldn't allow Muslims to wear headscarves in jail? No, what? I am saying this is just another example of the judicial system making allowances for a defendant because she is white. You could totally pass for white. Holy sh What? It's not please like don't. she's please black stop. Please she no. wasn't wearing a headscarf. Your Honor, I am Speechless. I doubt that. Everything about Ms. Glenn is an insult to my identity as a Muslim, as an Iranian, as a woman. Make sure you save some indignation for the actual trial. We have a room full of press and a defendant dressed up like Muslim Barbie, who you have somehow already compared to St. Joan and Rosa Parks. So let's not pretend the trial hasn't already begun.